Everything about you is so sexy. Go power! I'd give myself a camel toe. Do you know what I mean? Hello! That was annoying. Hello and welcome to a Thursday haul. Now I know right now I'm in my Super Haul Sunday background, so I am cheating and breaking the rules, but I was far, far, far too excited about this Boohoo haul that I couldn't wait guys. And can we just take a moment to guess what, what, what? what boohoo haul this is gonna be a any idea no well it's blooming disney so boohoo have come out with a disney specifically mickey mouse it seems collection so i am here with a bunch of goodies literally it launched on like monday or tuesday of this week so if you guys want to get your hands on it go now before it sells out use my code misha20 to save 20 percent off site-wide excluding sales and thank you so much to boohoo for sponsoring this video i'm so excited you guys know i am a hundred percent a real disney fan and a boohoo fan so that's why I've whacked out the Disney ears I need to stop talking so quickly but I'm just a bit too excited also I haven't filmed a video here since having this cupboard here this now houses all of my makeup what do we think it does to the aesthetic does it look okay does it look ugly let me know anyway you came here to see the boohoo stuff so let's get Disneyified, people. I picked these pieces out yesterday. I haven't seen them. They are quite literally fresh off the press. Don't think that's a thing. But yeah, if you've been living under a rock, you wouldn't know that they brought out this specifically Mickey collection. Oh my gosh, I'm seeing so much Mickey Mouse and I love it. I feel like I needed this when I was in America, but then it is more like autumnal winter pieces, so that's not a bad thing. Okay, now, first thing I'm gonna grab, I'm literally just gonna grab at random items and we're gonna see. So, this is a t-shirt dress. Now, if you don't know me, I love me a good t-shirt dress. I just think they are such a good invention, and OMG, guys, this is so soft. Oh my God. Imagine, yeah guys, this is the dress and it's actually plain back. <laughs> no, no, no. Guys, look. Now this does kind of look like pajamas, but I would a million percent wear this outside. Like I really don't mind looking like I'm wearing my PJs outside. I think it's quite a fashionable look. <gasps> and imagine this with red knee highs. Oh my God. Okay, I'm getting all Christmassy vibes. Misha, stop, it's still August. Technically. Is it still all good when this video is up? Just about. Oh my gosh, I'm loving on this. I think it's beautiful. <gasps> the fabric is honestly so soft. And I got this in a size six. So let's try this on as we go because I know you guys love them like that. I just have to be really careful not to flash anyone, any belongings to mine. Yes. I'm too excited not to come in. Well, so far, do I, do I qualify? Do my ears qualify? <laughs> oh, you just knocked mine off. Oh, look how cute. Kind of looks like pajamas, but I don't really mind. It's a little t shirt, t -shirt. dress. That is so Imagine cute. it with red knee highs. Sexy. sexy. <laughs> Everything about you is so sexy. Okay, let's put this on. We, we just two alike. This is yeah. just a nightmare. I'm going to put this on. Bye. Bye. So. I kind of want to go to bed right now, but like a fashion. Can I just interrupt this? What? So Misha is working hard, so I said to her, shall I get your fruit ready? Do you know what she replied? No, mum, don't cut my melon because you won't cut it properly. <laughs> correctly. Sorry, that was the word. She correctly. can't cut fruit okay. Are you surprised she's still single? Because I'm not. <laughs> but mum, how curable is this? It is. I just put the word cute and adorable in one to adorable. You can wear it um, as a pyjamas and you can also wear it out. Yeah. Can you imagine woolly, woolly tights? Red woolly tights. No high knee boots, not with that. I one. think high knee boots. No. I think not no, woolly tights. No, but no. no. This is so, I'm going to feel how soft it is. Oh. So soft. Okay, wait. Whilst mum's here, we're going to have to go to this item. So excited. So, this is actually from the men's collection, but 
No one need to tell us who can dress and wear well. Exactly. That not make Misha any sense. the king. Anyway. Oh. oh. Are you ready? Okay, so this is the front. It's just a blue denim jacket. I don't with... know any blogs that would wear that, personally. But no. Man, good on you, blue. Yes. Keep men in touch with the feminine side. Am I being sexist? Yes, you are. You are being sexist. And I'm going to find myself, my Mickey Mouse, and we're going to go out in matching Disney clothes from Boohoo together. And we're going to use my redundant. code, Misha20. <laughs> but anyway, okay, so this is the front. Right, I've told Misha about 10 times now she's got lipstick on her on her uh, teeth. So please um, keep on telling her. Comment down below. Misha, you've got lipstick. It might be a bit late, but you know. I just farted. And again. Will there ever be a haul without a... And that wasn't mine, that was hers. Okay. Oh, blinky curl. It doesn't Sorry. smell. Stop lying. Another reason why she's single. Okay, can we just shush? And are we ready? In yep. three, two, yeah. one. So, although this is men's, I was like, I really don't care because I quite like the oversized fit. That is this not an adorable outfit? So cute. What size is it? I don't actually know what size I've got. Considering Probably it's... one size. I think it's probably a size small. Is it a small? I don't really know men's sizing. Small? Small? Yeah, there we go. It's like a women's oversight. Oh, I like it with a collar on. Oh, my funky. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to wear it, so you show Mickey. Okay, yes. Mum's now departing us. Bye, Minnie. And I love this. Bye, it's... Maxi. <laughs> that's just rude. But it's so, so cute. And yes, it is quite a boxy oversized fit, but I don't mind that at all. And then look. The back is where it steals my heart. Heart people. Yes, so if Mickey Mouse, my future Mickey Mouse, could let me know when you're gonna pop up so that I can be ready and waiting. Pretty please. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Okay. Oh, but I love all these pieces. They're so cute. Oh, and of course, I will link them all down below so you guys can check them out before they sell out. Oh my god, I love it! And just to prove, this does say Boohoo Man on it, but YOLO! Oh, okay, okay, okie dokie. This is more of like a lounge wear collection, but I think that's really good because not everyone would have the hoonas or the balls to go out in these sort of pieces for like your like dressy occasions or anything like that. So I think it's quite nice that these are lounge weary that you can wear at home if you don't want to admit to the world that you're a huge Disney fan or you can do a me and literally just sing it from the rooftops and everyone will see you in your Mickey Disney Boohoo attire. So you may have guessed before I started blabbering on that these are sweat pants. Are they sweat pants, jogger pants? Is sweat pants American and then jogger pants English? I think so. But again, they're not just plain black. They actually have, where is it? Mini on the leg. So there is some more subtle pieces in the collection, which I think is fabulous because again, if you are a diehard Disney fan, but you're not necessarily uh, open to tell the whole world, I mean, I don't know why not. You can go for these. And yeah, I've kind of got them on with the top, the dress right now, but it could be an oversized top. <gasps> oh my gosh. These are so so comfy. OMG. And look also, they have an elasticated waistband with like these ties. So if I wanted to go really high waisted, give myself a camel toe, I could, but I'm more of like a stretch them out, let all the food in. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. And look at the leg. You guys can't really see it, but they're adorable and they're so soft. But um, let's put a top on with these rather than this nighty t-shirt dress situation. Wait, no, there's a jumper. I literally, I don't know why I always forget what I order. <gasps> no, guys, it's actually a sweater. No, wait, is this a sweater dress? <gasps> it's a sweater dress. Okay, I'm going to have to come back to that. Let's go to a t-shirt. Now, this definitely is a t-shirt. I promise I'm not confused this time. So... I actually do have a right plethora of Disney t-shirts, but I'm just gonna add to the collection. So this is more of an oversized fit. I got this in a, is this a one size or a UK 
six to eight so it is from the back just a plain black tee so you know miley cyrus where it was like business in the front party in the back this time it's business in the back party in the front oh my gosh also these have loads of m's on them and as you can see by all the m's in the background an M is in my name because I'm Misha and apparently I can't remember how to spell my name so I have to have props to remind me but this is basically kind of like Misha clothes personalised Misha clothes OMG I actually remember now um, they had this on with like black cycling shorts and that is how I do think I may wear it also this headband literally saves a multitude of greasy hair sins okay so not only could you have it as like a long t-shirt I reckon I could even wear this as a t-shirt dress but with my black joggers comfort fashion airport outfit for Ibiza I leave in literally like three days which is so exciting but there is a lot to do before I leave and yeah I love this love this love this I think it's such a casual smart sassy outfit put some white trainers with it the world is your oyster I've been dying 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 to see these now as you can see there's a little a little mickey on the butt cheek of these jeans so they are just really plain and simple jeans but then there is a little added extra bonus that people may not even notice but you know that you have mickey mouse on your butt cheek so i'm gonna pop these on they kind of look like a mom style jean should i check the label because they probably tell me i do not know but i got these in a uk six and let's pop these bad boys on i do love boohoo jeans i think they are such nice quality and yeah i haven't tried me like these though oh exciting okay so here we have the jeans and these actually fit me really nicely along the thigh they aren't probably like a mom jean they're more like a straight leg but i am struggling to bend to show you and then look it's like if you are really funky and you are part of the disney crew then you get the mickey mouse butt cheek and look they fit on my thighs but then also they actually fit back here which am i the only person that always struggles to find jeans that fit around their waist and their bum and i don't even have a very big bum but no, I love them. They don't have the most stretch in them. So maybe do size up if you like your jeans a little bit more of a baggy fit. But I mean, they're really cute. And I know you can't quite properly see them. But I promise you, they're lovely. They're lovely jubbly. Oh, and they've got rolled up hems, which look cute. This is way too much exercise for me. Let's move on to the next item. Now, this is another little t-shirt. So here we have this white one now if this does not scream mickey mouse and disney to you i don't know what does it's just exactly the same as this one just in the white and just a little bit more simple a little bit more sophisticated a little bit less ott but beautiful nonetheless and imagine this with little red cycling shorts sticking out underneath that would be adorable people okay let's take off the ears this is getting serious this could actually be my favorite piece so far just because i think everyone could wear this t-shirt it's so comfy it's so cozy it's like a perfect tee and then also you could roll up the sleeves if you want to be like the coolest kid in the disney school <gasps> imagine if that was a thing oh my gosh i wish i went to disney school What's people's favourite Disney film? Let me know down below, because mine was Frozen for a bit, but I don't know. There's too many good ones. Is there even a Mickey Mouse film? Or is there just a TV programme? Am I being blonde? And it's definitely not natural blonde either, can we see these roots? <laughs> In case you didn't know, I'm obsessed with melon. And as mum can't cut it correctly, I've gone to the extent of cutting it myself on the melon. I hope you guys have got a snack as well. Mmm, that's good. I'm now getting lipstick everywhere. A 
apart from my mouth. Okay, so <laughs> I think I'm drunk on Disney. So let's now move on to a sweater. And I will come back to that black sweater dress I was talking about, I promise. So, oh my gosh, I am in... And look, it's Minnie. Minnie made an appearance. Girl power. <laughs> How cute is this? It's just like a grey sweater. Again, I have some grey cycling shorts that would look adorable with this. Who would have known Misha would be into cycling shorts? How things change. Let's pop this on because we are layering the Disney stuff, aren't we guys? Oh my gosh. This is literally every Disney big kids, little kids dream. Oh. Aim of the game not to get my makeup all over the hoodie. Okay, here we go. Okay, dark people. Now, can I just say the first reason as to why I blooming love this sweater? Okay, I know this seems really stupid and I can't be the only person that has this problem but I always wear t-shirts like this and then I'll put on a jumper and literally it will be like that and I just think that looks really weird whereas this one, like look, they actually sit in the perfect position that you cannot see my t-shirt underneath and I know this is a very different vibe for me because it's quite casual and you guys normally see me looking very dressy but you know I can be cool I can be cash I don't know what these sort of movements are but let's move onwards this is actually really soft and really cozy and I'm in love with it okay oh oh turns out I actually got another top because I seem to be a with Disney t-shirts, but again, this one is the more subtle. And am I the only one that thinks that genuinely looks like it says Misha? M-I-S-H-A. Aw, boohoo and Disney decided to put my name on the top. I'm obviously joking, I wish that was a thing. But again, a more subtle version for your more subtle person that doesn't want to scream four-year-old dreams. Okay, let's pop this bad boy on. Sorry, um, this was just me reenacting me waking up at my non-existent boyfriend's house and like wearing his t-shirt, because you know I wore his t-shirt to bed, but he's actually make-believe. <laughs> Sad, sad times. But do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? When I say this kind of looks like my boyfriend's tea, but as I don't have one, it'll have to be my dad's tea. Oh, I just burped. <laughs> or my sister's boyfriend's tea. But that just gets a bit weird, doesn't it? A little bit dodgy. Anyway, so this is the t-shirt, very subtle, unlike me. Now I'm actually gonna take off my pants, which again is not something that I should say on YouTube, but I wanna see if these are long enough to be a t-shirt dress, cause multi-use people. Sorry, it's, it's, it's difficult to get jeans off. When they fit well, they fit well. Oh. Also, it's not at all see-through, like you cannot see my, and I'm not wearing anything. Not that I should be telling anyone that. Okay, I'm stuck in the jeans, people. I'm actually stuck. My ankles, I can't get my legs up. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. I didn't take them off very well, and you know when they just get caught on your socks? I might just take off my socks. Okay, no, I think, no. I'm gonna, guys, I'm gonna be stuck in these jeans forever. I don't know what to do. Oh my God, sometimes I do this and it gives me an actual like panic attack, which I know sounds ridiculous. But you know when you're just like, oh my God, we're gonna be stuck in them forever. I can't get out. I actually can't. Guys, I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't. Oh my gosh, please send help. Boohoo girls, you're gonna have to come and cut me out of the jeans because I accidentally rolled over the ankles too much and I can't get them off. I love how my other foot will come out really easily. It's only this foot that you know when you accidentally get it caught on your sock and it keeps on rolling. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. 
you're having a bad day, at least just think you're not as much of a mess as Misha. I'm gonna have to go get Dad to help me. Papa Grimes did it! It just turns out that my acrylic nails are too long and I couldn't like get it to the right position, but Dad did it in a one hit wonder. I'm out, I still love the jeans, I just kinda need an assistant when it's time to take them off. Imagine though, I went on like a jolly with a gentleman and then like things were getting a little bit heated and then I like tried to take off my jeans and then I was like, sorry, can you pull on my jeans? I can't get them off. <laughs> That is something that would happen to me. When I have some like interesting stories like that that are hilarious, I will share them. But as we know, I'm not very wild, so I don't have any of those right now. But anyway, back to this. It is the perfect length for a t-shirt dress. You cannot see my hoo-ha. My bum cheeks aren't hanging out. I love it. It's beautiful. Okay, now I've just spotted some red. Is this actually the first red item I picked out? Wowzers, okay, so I'm thinking layering this up, it's just a hoodie. So I always get confused, a sweater has no hood and a hoodie blatantly, obviously, has a hood. Right, these are all really soft and fleecy, so. Hello, hello. I, I wouldn't wear it like that fashionably, but if it was raining, then maybe. So here we go, again, perfect. You cannot see the neckline, I love that. So, here's a kind of little outfit, just a little cash. I'm going to the airport because apparently I live my life at the airport according to my wardrobe decisions. But I think it's really cute and cozy and I just need more, more loungewear. More sweatwear, I really don't. I don't need any more of anything, but that doesn't stop me, people. Also, I posted a picture of me and Papa Grimes on the gram. Here you go, just in case you'd never seen my dad before. He's not my boyfriend, he's my father. Okay, bizarre, let's move onwards. Finally, we're gonna come back to this, which I unpackaged earlier, but I never tried it on, and this is me and Mama Grimes, because I don't have my Mickey Mouse, as I said a million times in this video. But look how cute it is! It's just like a little sweater dress. So it's kind of like this, but hoodless, with a different emblem on the front, in black and long. So absolutely nothing like this. But let's pop it on for the final piece of this haul. And I will get my ears back, but they've just been annoying me. Last, but by certainly not least, we have this little jumper, dress, sweater, thingy my bobby and I feel like I need to go to Disneyland Paris around Christmas now just for the pure purpose of shooting all this boohoo stuff. Literally, I want to go right now and book to go to Disneyland because this is definitely a valid excuse but that does not mean that you need to be in Disney or Anywhere Disney themed to wear these clothing, I will a million percent be wearing them in my normal everyday life because I am proud to be a 19 year old Disney fan and I hope you guys are too if you're watching this, I'm assuming you are a fan as well. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this midweek haul, it's a Thursday today and hauls are normally on a Wednesday but we're changing things up, yes. So, I'm gonna wrap this video up. I will, of course, link all the items down below. I hope you've all enjoyed. I'm getting a bit sleepy now, but it is quite late for me filming this. I think it's like half seven. 7.22, I was very close. Um, and that's bedtime. Joking, I go to bed at like 3 a.m. normally. But I am gonna remove this red lipstick because I've literally got it all over the white t-shirts. Idiot Misha. But anyway, I will link all the items down below. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And also, oh, so, whilst I've kind of mid got lipstick on, slash not got lipstick on, Boohoo have actually got a new thing to their system, which is a refer a friend discount and money off 
scheme, let's call it. Yes, Misha is confusing that a lot more than it needs to be. But basically, if you are to recommend a friend to Boohoo, not only will you get a £5 voucher and off your next purchase, but they will get 25% off their online order. So yes, if you want to go recommending Boohoo to a friend, then you do that because you can get money and they can get money off. What's not to love? So I'm going to love you and leave you. Toodle pip. Make sure to do a like and subscribe. And I will see you all next time. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Disney kisses. Ooh, still got it on my tooth.